You might have heard Control X Core referred to as a smartphone of automation. The smartphone idea is a good analogy to the architecture that runs the Control X platform. Similar to iOS or Android on a phone, Control X runs Linux Ubuntu Core as an operating system. Ubuntu Core is a containerized operating system that organizes functions into apps just like your smartphone. These apps run on top of the data layer that facilitates communication between all the apps. Some examples of Rexroth apps that run on the core are the PLC app, the Motion app, and OPC UA app. There are many Rexroth apps on our App Store and many more apps from our Control X World partners. Third-party apps can be used as well, and you'll find thousands of these in the Snapcraft Store. In this video, you will learn where to find apps and how to import and install apps into the Control X Core device. All right, let's install some apps. I'm going to open up Control X Works to go online to the core that is connected. Type in the password, the username. Now this is the startup screen, here on the left side we will see all the apps that are installed, uh, if you had some installed. Under settings we go to apps, so here we can see all the apps that are installed. We can look at the system apps, so those are apps that are factory installed. Now we want to install some additional uh, apps, we can do this two ways. There's a number one online store, if your device is actually connected to um, the device portal you can get apps directly from here or local storage means you have the app already downloaded to your PC and you can install it the first thing we have to do is put the device in service mode you can see over here uh, the indicator LED is green so right now we're in operating mode we'll switch it to service mode and now you can see the LED uh, changes the light so now uh, to add an app we click this plus symbol we find the apps so we're going to install the motion and the plc app so you can see it says uploading to files so now we're um, on here and now we can install the plc app and we can start the other one already as well so now we can see uh, the plc app is successfully installed the motion app is finishing up and now the motion app is also successfully installed and we can also see it already showed up here on the left side. Here's the motion and the PLC app. We're gonna switch it back to operating mode now. And now if we go back to the installed apps, we see they're both here. And then we have access to the motion apps if you wanna configure an access or a kinematic, you can do this here. 